Hey guys, welcome back to the Party Chat Society today. Kyle and Kyle. Holy crap, it's been a while since you've been on the channel. I, I blame Kyle. It's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? Uh, today we have an unboxing of the Monster Hunter World Collector's Edition. This is his Collector's Edition. Mine actually won't be here until Monday. Damn shit. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm super excited. Yeah. This will be your first Monster Hunter game. I have never played a Monster Hunter game ever. So. They're amazing. They've kind of simplified some things to make it more accessible to people. So this is the perfect one to start with. Excellent. And I heard it's a grind fest, so I like grind. Yes. Grind Lord. Let's go. <laughs> all right. We already pre-opened it, so there's not a whole bunch of just noise getting all Opening, the... Opening, cutting, yeah. blah, blah, blah. So a little uh, cover, and then a little ding, but oh well. Yeah. Shipping. Go grab the bottom there. Oh, yes. Uh, this was a GameStop exclusive? Yes, the collector's edition, I believe, was GameStop exclusive. Ugh. And so was the PS4. Which I will get Monday as well. Woo! Woo! Besides that little box there. This is just black, so there's no... Pretty good cardboard there. Yeah. So, of All right. course. Yeah, go ahead and take it. Right game out. right on top. And then a couple cards with DLC codes, which you don't get to see. My codes. <laughs> Soundtrack and some deluxe codes. I think you can buy part of the deluxe stuff if you just want to spend the extra money without the collector's edition itself. Hmm. So there's, I think there's like skins and armor you can get. Right on. So, I mean, that's kind of a cool thing if, if you wanted those but didn't have the 150 to drop on right. the collector's edition. Alrighty. Next we have ooh, a monster designs art book i'm not sure how many pages this is i've heard only 35 it's pretty thin but it's like i guess super beautiful looking nice so i decent quality paper too wow looks like. yeah these monsters look awesome. so freaking good this is, this is what i've been waiting for like i love monster hunter but the games are always very muddy and ugly because mm -hmm. it's it's only been on handheld it's, it's even uh, it's got some uh, raised up Ooh, embossing. Yeah. yes so Use yeah, fancy I, words now. This Jeez. game is like beautiful, like mm -hmm. super freaking awesome looking. Alrighty, uh, it's All your right. statue. It's my statue. Take it out. It's pretty plain. Pretty plain <laughs> statue. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's pretty is, white. It's more white than I thought. Yeah. It's called Box Hunter, right? Box Hunter, <laughs> yes. Uh, so the statue is of the, the Nergagante, which is the new ancient dragon. One of the new ancient dragons, I should say. Kind of thing that they decided to be their mascot for the game. Man, hopefully and you it's heard broken. it over that. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Box. Plastic. Plastic. Alrighty. So a bunch more plastic. And then the statue. It is shows. so freaking wow. good looking. Like very, it's, it's small. But very detailed. But it's so good looking. My god hook your eye out with this. <laughs> um, so, like, the main thing about this monster is the longer you fight it, the darker its, like, scales and stuff become. Okay. And if you're actively attacking them, it'll break apart. So you don't want him to gain all of his dark spikes because then he gains more attacks mm. and kind of, like, an enraged, like, shoot him at you and becomes, like, hard and you can't really break things anymore when it gets too hard. Okay. So, Wow. This thing is really freaking cool looking. Very nice. I'm kind of glad that it's not gigantic. Yeah, we were talking earlier. I have too many gigantic statues. Yeah. It's like kind of nice to get a smaller it's one. It's nice. Little itty bitty, incredibly detailed, really nicely painted. Mm -hmm. God, it looks so freaking good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very awesome. You'll get a close up photo, of course. Of course. Very awesome. So yeah, 150, uh, GameStop exclusive. Uh, good luck finding one. Yeah, I, they're very limited at this point. Yeah. But yeah, so, I, uh, I, I'm happy to start my Monster Hunter adventure. <laughs> this is the perfect one to start with. Oh, I'm yeah. so excited. Oh, yeah. I've already got offers of, like, hey, you gonna, gonna hunt with us? I'm like, sure, I guess. <laughs> I don't I, I don't know how to play the game, so I hope you uh -oh. show me. <laughs> You'll get it. It's oh, fine. Yeah. So that is it for the Collector's Edition. Yep. Pretty simple, but very nice. Yes. It's very awesome. Everything is very high quality. Mm -hmm. So I'm... I can't wait for mine to get here. Yeah. But I'll be playing the game in the meantime. Yep. Awesome. So. All right. Anything else? I think that's it. 
Welcome so, to 2018. 2018. Yeah. Woo! 200 <laughs> subscribers. We hit yeah, 200. We did while we were uh, on a break. Yeah. <laughs> thanks, guys. So, thanks, guys. I'm glad that we had something worthwhile to stick around. Stick around. Yep. So, uh, we should be getting more videos coming soon. Yes. I can't say why yet, but it's potentially, potentially some opportunity. Oh, yeah. So, thanks, guys, and we will catch you next time. All right, that is our Monster Hunter World Collector's Edition unboxing. Thanks for sticking around until the end of the video. Here's some gameplay of the game. It is very fun. I have about 15 hours into it already. It's only been out for a day. So I hopefully that just shows how much I freaking love the game. I love the statue. I love everything about it. So thanks for watching, guys. And take care. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.